I'm a UKM student leader. I love to help people. So then my leaders told me, if you want to help people, you have this compassion and the passion you want to, to help, you join politics. You'll get elected. Then you, this political commitment, political strength, you can help more people. You can change the policy. You can make the country more for, move forward. That's why I joined politics from young. And that's why I'm here. And even today, even I lost in last year, I still committed. You know, my, my enthusiasm is still there to serve the people of Bentong. And not easy for me to make a comeback, you know. A lot of people ask, why? Why you make a comeback? You know, people of Bentong love me and I hope that I can offer my services and hopefully they can, they can give me another chance and give Bentong another chance to move forward. And I can see the warmness in them. I have a few uh, gatherings with uh, locals. They uh, welcome me with open arms. As compared to the past four years, we can see that they, they realised that uh, they didn't get the services they needed because earlier the Member of Parliament and Adun did not put emphasis on development agenda. I would like to attract more young people to stay back in Bentong. I want to create more jobs in Bentong. I want, to, I want them to stay here to help to develop Bentong. They can actually have high income job in Bentong. And that's where we introduced beside enhancing our agricultural product, you know, using technology to produce higher yield. At the same time also, we wanted to encourage ecotourism, agro-tourism, and this will double their income. Uh, I'm not that old, and I'm also an experienced, uh, uh, what we call, committed uh, workers uh, for people of Bentong, and I will be able to listen to the wishes of the young people. I can also voice out the wishes of young people, not necessarily young people to voice out the wishes of young people. That's why we need a, a, a vibrant economy. If there is no vibrant economy, we can't have a shopping mall. They want a bowling alley, uh, they want a good shopping mall, they want a lot of uh, uh, high-speed internet, all of facilities here. Yes, we hear that, we hear the young. So, I hear you, I know I can voice out for you and I'll implement what they wish. That fire is really a very sad case, you know. More than 50 houses were burned down, shop lots were burned down. There is time where they need help as a former MP here without any position. But I think that I can do something for them. And we are fortunate that this team that uh, supported uh, our, our initiative has succeeded to complete all these processes within a year and now the development of new houses is on the way. So the people understand that I'm, I'm, I'm here, it's not for political manoeuvring, it's no, nothing we do political manoeuvring. It's all strictly just with one sincere heart to help the people of Bentong.